Then I said, oh, it's a hole up in the ceiling. When their friend cried out, I've been shot. Blood is just gushing out of his leg. Poe quickly made a tourniquet, and Daniel Beard grabbed his keys. We just said, hey, we just got to get him to the hospital. They called 911 on the way to Columbia St. Mary's. Police quickly respond to 504 East Center. It is empty. But no one's there. If you want to just do me a favor and go talk with my partner. Outside the emergency room, Next thing you know, you hear, the victim's friends tell police oh, what they saw. I thought the civil fan went out. And Poe alerts an officer. And I do carry a service weapon, too. He is carrying a gun. I was always told to say that. Yep, nope, yeah. that's good. There's nothing wrong yeah. with that. As one officer heads in to meet with the victim. What room did he go? Others separate the witnesses. And once again, Beard so we just sat there. That's the power. and Poe explain what happened? There's a hole in the ceiling. Oh, Larry's right. I've been shot. Well, he said, I've been shot. I'm like, what? And blood is pouring on his leg. At the same time, police force their way into the lounge. Milwaukee police, anybody in here, announce yourself. And find a bullet hole in the ceiling. Oh, yeah, right here. Just as the witnesses described. So I'm sure this one's probably not going to be too hard for him to solve. For the next hour. Man, that's crazy. Officers engage the men in light conversation. Is it like a members only kind of place? Members private only, yeah. But then. Sir, we're gonna, you're, you're going to have to come with me. Their tone changes. Oh, no, I'm not going to have a car. You're crazy. You're crazy as hell. A citizen in the hospital lobby starts his own recording. As police learn, there's a second shooting victim. Uh, at first, 20-year-old Cameron Lee told workers at Mount Sinai Hospital he'd been shot by a passing car. Why don't you, instead of adding a charge of, like, lying, why don't you just tell me what happened? But Lee eventually admitted to detectives he was in the apartment above the lounge showing off a gun to some girls when it accidentally went off. They, like, shot through my pants, everything. Not only did Lee shoot himself, the bullet went through the floor and struck a man in the lounge below. What are the, the uh, chances of that? But instead of sticking around to explain what happened. I'm shot. I'm shot. What the f am I supposed to do? With Lee that? panicked. There's got to be another way out. There's got to be another way out. There's like, there's not. There's not. Jumped from a second story balcony. That was a pretty big jump. And ran. I don't know how I did it, but I just did it. When officers asked the tenants upstairs what happened. Hi, this is Milwaukee Hi. Police. Is anyone else shot upstairs? No. They lied. Told them they didn't see or hear anything. That only added to the confusion back at Columbia St. Mary's. I'm not sitting back in the back Where the focus turned to Michael Poe. We have reasonable suspicion that a crime has been committed. For me? Yes. You guys are telling me I, could, I shot my friend. I don't, on, I don't see it. That's why I say you're not under arrest. Officers assured Poe he was not under arrest, but also that he had no choice but to come with them for questioning. It's either you stand up and you go to our car or you can do it in cuffs. I'm not standing up and I'm not doing it in cuffs either. Why not? Because I'm not. Well, it's not I'm not. From there. I'm telling you, man, I'm not going up like that.